So let's get right into it. We're going to make a Christmas ornament out of scrap fabric and also some things that I found in my yard, like the tree. I just cut me some tree branches. So you can either use tree branches from your yard. You can use uh, cinnamon sticks. And I thought about using some clothes pins. So we'll see if that is going to work. The other thing you will need is some glue sticks. You will also need your heat gun. You will also need some scissors. You will also need to go maybe on Google or if you know how to draw, you can make your own tree template. And then I made this star using construction paper and then I just heat pressed some um, vinyl onto this. It's not the best looking star. So if you want your star to be perfect, you can cut it out with your Cricut or Silhouettes um, Cameo or anything of that nature. And then I have some blue jean material that I'm going to use for my um, tree. I also cut out this pattern. I have another color blue jean. I'm also going to incorporate this green. I also have this color and then this color. So these strips are one inch strips, one inch by seven, one by seven inch strips. You're also going to need some twine and some scissors. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do, depending on what you're going to use for the base of your tree, I'm going to use maybe two of these sticks. Uh, so depending on what you want to use for the base of your tree, you're going to, let me try to line these up so that they, I can at least get them close enough. Okay, so I think I'm going to do it like this. You want to, whatever you're going to use for the bottom of your tree trunk, you want to kind of line it up to where it's budding up against one another. And then you're going to take your, um, let me get this stuff out your way. You're going to take your glue gun and then just glue all the way up. And then you're going to put it together and let it hold. Just hold it for about five seconds. Now, play with this glue gun at your own risk because the glue gets hot, um, but that's what we have, okay? And then once this sets, okay, now you're gonna take your twine And the only thing you want to do with this is you want to take it to the top, glue it together, glue it on your, your stick. And what you're going to do is just make a loop so that your tree can hang. Okay, so let me cut a piece of this. And it just depends on you how far or how long you want your ornament to hang off of your tree. So we're going to glue these two, the two ends. Just like this. I'm trying not to get my hand hot. Okay, so you see now you have that loop. Let that sit for a second. And then what you want to do is... You want to take your, you want to take your um, strips of fabric, and you want to start whatever, um, whichever pattern you want to go with. You just want to take your strips, and then you're going to tie each strip onto. your base, okay? 
And if you want to, you can hot glue this part down. So I'm just going to kind of get in there and glue that down, okay? And then you're just going to keep tying your strips all the way down. You want to get them kind of close to each other to fill in the gap. So you may have to like tie it and then slide it up. But I'm just going to be quiet now and let y'all watch the rest of this, okay? And I'm just going to say, please hit the like button. Okay, so for the next one, we're going to use the uh, clothespin. Okay, so this is what your the first one should look like so far. Okay, just make sure that you kind of fan your scrap pieces out. And we'll continue this one as soon as we get this one done. So what I decided to do for the clothespin, I'm going to just move this out the way so you don't get distracted is take the one inch strip and then I'm going to use my pinking shears and I'm just going to split this in half. No special measurements, just do the best you can, eyeball it and split this in half. And then we're going to do the same exact thing. We're just going to take the top of our clothespin, slide this down. And then we're just going to tie it. Now, you may have to put this on something so that it stays put, but just do the best you can. Okay. And so we'll just build this one up until we get all the way to the top. And this part will actually become our leg or the trunk of the tree. And you can just clip it on 
to the tree instead of having the rope hanging it down. So I'll finish this and we'll come back. Okay, so now we have both of our fake trees kind of made, right? This is the first time that I am trying it with the clothespin. I'm really not liking the way that the um, fabric is kind of like um, not stiff. However, I'm going to try it anyway just to see what it looks like. And also, I did not make a star for this particular one. So I'll just show you with my makeshift star that I made, what it should look like or what it could look like once you're done. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take our template of our Christmas tree. And what I did was I put a little um, double-sided tape on the back of this. And then I'm going to like put it onto the tr this part of the fabric and i'm gonna use it <laughs> as a guide to cut out the shape of the tree now this may work and it may not so let's just let me kind of move i think i should have made this a little longer but nonetheless we're gonna try it okay so we're just gonna cut so the template is not really working out too well for me <laughs> uh, so we just gonna Act like we know what we're doing. Okay, so this, and then it went down, and then it came up. So. Does it kind of look like a tree to you? <laughs> it's going to be all right. I mean, cut it in the best way, shape, form that you can. And just remember, 
is your creation and your tree. And so now we will put, I will just show you the star, what it would look like at the top. I'm not going to actually put it on yet, but that's what the ornament will look like, okay? So now let's try it with the next one. So, my star is not perfect, but I think this is so cute. So, this concludes the video, and hopefully, you try this. I am going to put the star on the big one, just because I will make another one of these and put it on the smaller one. But let's at least finish one. <laughs> finish it off. And if you have a better star, I promise you it would look a whole lot better. I probably should have moved it up. But remember, this is paper. This is construction paper in HTV. Let me see if I move it up. How it's going to look. At least have the the tip pointing at the top. And then I guess you could just fluff it out. 
It doesn't really look like a tree. <laughs> However, it's still cute. Maybe. <laughs> Tell me what you think in the comments. Um, maybe I could make this go up. Okay, yeah. Let's do that. Trial and error. Okay. Trial and error. That's better. Okay. Let's move this out the way. That's better. Sorry if this video took so long, but... Did the, the paper tour off of that? Okay. So it's still kind of iffy. Okay, I think it's cute. I think it's cute. Okay, so these are the two versions. And so this one will clamp onto the tree. Make sure you put your star. I didn't have another star, so make sure you put your star. And that's it. Thanks for watching. See you on the next video.